it's about time that I start writing, right? For the first time ever, never before seen on this channel, never before a thing I've ever done ever, I will be making my very first show Bible. <laughs> I think it's pretty cool. It's it's kind of like a pitch of what the show will be, the tone of the show, what the show is gonna be like, and... Okay, so this is editing, Monica. Um, if you hear some, like, scratching noises in the background, that is my cat, Gemini. She decided to take a giant poo in the middle of me recording. <laughs> I know, rude. But, you know, what can I say? Cat's gonna cat. I have never made one of these before. So I did a little research. I had a friend send me some show Bibles and I looked those over. And I, I decided, you know what? I want to make one of those because it kind of feels like I'm back in school again and I'm like making a project for my English class or something. It's kind of like a book report or something. And I just think it would be fun and cool to make a show Bible. I have not yet written the pilot, but upon my research, I discovered that you do not have to write the pilot first. You can do the Bible first as a way to help you get into like the mood of the show and what kind of show it is. So you basically talk about the theme, the setting, the characters, um, maybe summarize overall what the show is about, a logline a summary. Also kind of what the mood is, comparing it to other types of shows that are similar or maybe other characters or just putting in pictures to convey the type of feeling that you want. Uh, I'm not 100% sure what I want those things to be. I, I don't know. However... I am going to put a little work into it and try and figure out what is it that I want. But I know that I want something. And, and you see my microphone? I'm just holding it in my hand. I'm just gonna hold it in my hand. Hey, this is editing Monica again. Um, so I start getting a little weird here and I didn't edit any of this out because I feel like when I do these talking head videos, I'll try to edit out my personality and like my weird little quirks and my weird little tangents because I, I go off on tangents like a lot when I'm recording these, but I cut most of that stuff out. But then I decided, you know what, I'm just going to leave some in because like if, th if this is who I am, then like this is who I am. I promise I get back on topic, but things veer left for like a little bit but um you know what it's what it is uh like this hello everybody welcome welcome back so let's just like explore my show bible a little bit and i'll scroll through and just kind of briefly talk about how i did it um i modeled it sort of loosely after the show Bible for Stranger Things, which had a completely different name. They were gonna call it Montauk or something. Montauk, Montauk, Montauk. They were gonna call it Montauk, but then they ended up calling it Stranger Things. And uh, my show is called Ghostly. And uh, it's very ghostly. And so, all of this, all of this, and I haven't written the actual pilot yet this is this is very fun <laughs> it, it feels a little stressful sometimes I feel like my ideas are bigger than my capacity to create them Ooh, ooh, that is that is some real truth do you see like the wicked mask tan that I have we have to wear a mask at work so all day all day my face is covered like this but Look at that. You can definitely see that there's like a harsh line and I'm I'm like dark chocolate from the eyes up and like milk chocolate from the eye down. Ooh. Ooh, I'm a mix. 
I'm like 90% cocoa up here and then like 70% cocoa. 70, 90, 70, 90, 70, 90. Um, nothing a little foundation won't fix. However, your girl doesn't be wearing makeup every day, so <coughs> I don't know why I'm acting so crazy. I've been talking for six minutes. Let's get into the meat of the video. Okay, so don't be mad at me, but I realized after recording this that it's probably not a good idea if I just blow my load and just show you guys my whole entire show Bible. I mean, here is the first page. I'm creating this in PowerPoint. I'm showing you the title page now. Um, the ghost is just some clip art that I got off the internet and... The font was black, but I changed the O and the S to a white font just because, you know, the ghost is black. And I thought it looked really cool. And it's like the coolest thing I've ever done in my whole entire life. And I'm just like, oh my God, this is so amazing. But basically, it's just a collection of pictures of movies and TV shows that I think are similar. Uh, I threw in some character descriptions. I wrote basically what the first season would be if it had franchise potential i wrote about the mood the tone stuff like that and you can google other examples of show bibles from what i was researching from what i found out in my research there's no right or wrong way to do this you could basically make it however you want. You just have to make sure you put in the most important elements of what your show is about, what you're trying to convey, who your characters are, the setting, the mood, the tone, that kind of stuff. Like the, 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 the meat and potatoes and everything else is just extra. We're, we're all born naked and the rest is drag. Um... So yes, I hope that I hope that that's not disappointing. Maybe I'll make a fake show Bible and show you that one, but I don't know. If I want Netflix to buy this, I can't just be posting it all over the internet, right? Like I probably shouldn't even be posting this. Like, ooh, ooh, did I already screw it up? Are they already not going to be interested cuz they're going to be like, "Oh, you made you made that 9-minute video about your and you know, so mm, we don't want it." You know what? whatever um whatever i i think this video is done now this video is done um thank you for watching my video though and if you're not subscribed you should subscribe because i'll have more weird content like this this is weird content i know it's a little bit it's a little quirky and kooky and not really you know what i've talked too much this video's done. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.